Hello friends, welcome to JavaScript video tutorial series. I right click on first script.html page, open with the notepad, minimize. I right click on first script.html page, open with the Firefox. In the previous video tutorial, we understood how we can display a text on the browser window. We have displayed hello world text by using document.write. The write method is the one which displays given string onto the browser window. What actually it does, it displays each of the characters one after the another from left to right, top to down in the browser window. In this tutorial, I am going to discuss about white space, how browser actually interprets white space, what happens when we have more than one white spaces in the write method. So here I have given hello, a lot of spaces and then word to the write method. If I I say file save go to browser and refresh you can see that I am not getting any spaces here the reason is if we have more than one white space browser is going to collapse those white spaces to a single space it actually collapses all those spaces to a single space final result is going to be like this file save go to browser and refresh we are getting the same result so remember that if you have many spaces maybe I can use a tab key to add more space the tabs are not going to be understood by the browsers all these spaces are going to be collapsed to a single space by the browser file save good browser refresh if I add more space file save good browser refresh I am getting the same result then how do we get more than one white spaces if we want to get more than one white spaces or if we want to add more white spaces then we need to take help of HTML entity that is non breaking space how do we write that we use ampersand then we write nbsp semicolon that is non breaking space it is an HTML entity friend. It adds a single space which is non-breaking space. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that I got one space. If we want more space, then we need to copy this HTML entity and paste it as many number of times you want. File, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that I am getting more spaces. I hope you guys have understood how browser interprets white spaces. So remember that if you have more than one white space, then browser collapses all those white spaces to single space. If you want to add more white spaces, then you have to use HTML entity ampersand nbsp semicolon that adds a single space. Remember that file, save, go to browser and refresh. Good. Next thing is I am going to discuss about how do you break a line? Let's take an example. I want to display hello world, one more hello world. Then what I can do is here in this write method, after the hello world, I can give one space and then I say one more time hello, then world, hello world, file, save, go to browser and refresh. You can see that I got one more hello world displayed on the browser window. This is how the write method works friend. If I want to display this hello world on the next line, I cannot use I cannot write like this I can I cannot hit enter if I hit enter if I say file save go to browser and refresh nothing we see because this is not a valid JavaScript statement this is actually not a proper syntax at all okay so that is not possible what I need to do file save go to browser and refresh is what I need to do to display this hello world on the next line means I have to use HTML break tag so I use less than br forward slash greater than this is the break tag we know that break tag breaks the line right it moves the cursor to the next line file save go to browser and refresh you can see now the next hello world is on the next line how it is working step by step all these characters are getting displayed one after the another you can from here to here then browser sees there is a break that means it moves the cursor to the next line then this hello world will get displayed there are you understanding so to break line we use the br tag hope you guys have understood how do you break the line similarly you can perform breaking the line in many ways for example i have written here document dot write hello world file save go to browser refresh okay i can copy this and paste it one more time file save go to browser and refresh you can see I got one more hello world but it is on the same line of course document dot write do not add any new line it won't break remember that 
JavaScript codes are executed top to down one statement at a time like this. So what happens here when you say document dot write hello world? Okay, this hello world will get display. Then again document dot write hello world you are telling that hello world will be getting displayed beside the previous hello world because you didn't told to the browser that where to break the line. To do that you have to use the br tag. So I use a br tag. Now we are telling to the browser that display this hello world then break the line then display this hello world. File save go to browser and refresh you can see that that hello world got displayed on the next line whatever you tell to the browser it does as you have told so it is your responsibility to tell to the browser what to do step by step whatever you tell the browser does that so remember that give your instructions precisely in a proper way tell browser everything in a proper way so that it performs its task in a better way it is programmers responsibility to tell to the browser what to do hope you guys have understood how browser interpret white spaces and how we can add break into the line. For this tutorial, this much is enough friends. I suggest you people to try yourself some code by using the document.write and the break tag. For more benefits and be updated, subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to like, comment and share these videos with others so that everyone will get benefited. Keep learning, keep coding, keep sharing. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. See you in the next tutorial.